My name is Nancy Gertner, and for 17 years I was a judge of the United States District Court for the District of Massachusetts. During those 17 years, I sentenced over 500 people to sentences of which 80%, I believe, were unfair and disproportionate. I left the bench in 2011 to join the Harvard faculty and to write, and to write about those stories, and to write about how it came to pass uh, that we were, that I was, obliged to sentence people to terms that frankly made no sense under any philosophy, any theory of retribution, any theory of social change. So my big idea is that it takes a cue from the World War II, post-World War II period, from the Marshall Plan. The Marshall Plan was unique because it set out not to punish uh, those who had been defeated and sow the seeds of future rebellion and future rage, but to rebuild, to look to the future and not to the past. Another version which is not quite as successful is obviously post-Civil War Reconstruction, which as we know was not as successful, but still the idea was not to punish, but to rebuild. Well, we finished a war, or we should be finishing a war. We finished a war on drugs, and although we were not remotely the victors of that war, we need a big idea in order to deal with those who were its victims. We need a plan to reconstruct neighborhoods, not countries, to be sure. We need a plan to stop punishing, as which is all that we have done in the past, uh, and to start rebuilding. What do I mean by a failed war on drugs? This is a, dr a war that I saw destroyed lives, eliminated a generation of African American men, covered our racism in ostensibly neutral guidelines and mandatory minimums, which were only applied or largely applied to African American men, created an intergenerational problem. Although I didn't, wasn't on the bench long enough to see this, we know that the sons and daughters of the people we sentenced are in trouble and are in trouble with the criminal justice system, fostered domestic violence because an entire generation of men were eliminated from these communities, uh, and eliminated, fundamentally eliminated their political participation. Again, we were not destroying cities as we did in leveling cities as we did in World War II with bombs, but with prosecution, prisons, and punishment. My Marshall Plan, my book, my effort to reconstruct the lives that I had a role in undermining is this. First, there's the Gertner Clemency Project. I'm trying to go through my list of people to see who deserves the, the president's clemency. But then we need a Marshall Plan that would be physical, deal with release from prison, that will be economic, rebuild these communities, that will be psychological, deal with the harms that we've created, and that will be political to restore political participation. The impact of the criminal justice system that I presided over in my small way was systemic. Our response to it has to be systemic. Thank you.